Hey Rams, it's me, Aja. So Rams, I'm Anthony. This is our fourth episode of Ram Train News. Even though our homecoming week is coming to an end, we'll still like to keep the tiny spirit alive. Welcome, Welcome back, back to, to Ram Nation. Nation. Now to talk about the digital sign. We need your help. Please support us in our effort to purchase a digital sign. The sign will be located in front of Tyner and used to show info around the school. The total cost of the sign will be $23,000. Please donate to Tyner Academy. Now to talk about basketball. Tyner Rams basketball is on its way. And we have a little look on the preseason workouts. Our Ram Train News team also got an exclusive meeting with Turner's own Joe Reed, who has taken in the role of conditioning our boys. The effort is to always give 100% in every exercise, every skill play, and everything you do. The tips I would give them would start first off, you can't be on a basketball court unless you get your grades in the classroom. Being on a basketball team don't mean nothing if you don't have the grade to get down here, to be on the court, to put that jersey on. Putting that jersey on mean a whole lot, but it don't mean nothing if you don't get the opportunity to put the jersey on because you're not doing what you're supposed to do in the classroom. Here are clips from Tyner, from Tyner Rounds preseason practice. Now to talk about football. Today we're going against Walker Valley. Even though we had a devastating loss Friday, today we have a new opportunity to win. Here's Coach T with his goals and expectations for his team. To see a whole lot of improvement from last Friday night, <laughs> which was non-existent. Boy Buchanan played full throttle, aggressive, physical, we played timid, cautious, and slow. Why do you think that your team did that? Well, that I really could not answer. If I could answer <laughs> that, I'd probably be a millionaire. <laughs> but uh, it was not pleasant. It was not pretty. Well, Rams, this has been our fourth episode of Ram Train News. AJ and I had some very sad, but good news. We will not be on Ram Train's news for the next two weeks. Tears. <laughs> but on the bright side, you have two new anchors for the next two weeks. Bye, Rams. We're going to miss you. See you next time. And we are going to leave off on a recap of Thursday's Paddle Puck game.